So guys, this is where I'm staying in the middle of Valladolid. It's called Mamacha Casa Hostel. Been here since 1918. Take a quick little tour inside. I'll leave the directions uh, in the comments. If you guys, I mean in the description, if you guys ever want to stay here. Real beautiful place, lots of old, old stuff. Got a check-in counter. Check out that 11. Not bad as most places. You got your own little kitchen in case you just want to buy some stuff from the supermarket or go to the, the market, buy some veggies, cook them up. Little fridge and everything, water, complimentary water. It's a nice little place. All the dishes and utensils. And then out here we have a little patio saving area where most people hang out at night. Early in the morning as well. Definitely needs fans because it's boiling hot out here in the summer. As you can see everything has really decorative art on it. This is one of the rooms of Nietos. It's a whole bunch of bunk beds. And they provide you with a extra fan that you can plug in next to your bed, next to you. Stay cool. It's a real nice place. Hammock to lay on and enjoy the day. Lots of plants. And decorations as I told you got the sinks here to wash your hands brush your teeth etc etc bathrooms lavatories I got showers uh, toilets everybody's out right now on tours and stuff so it's a perfect time to show everybody what the place looks like not many people around these are the bathrooms this is the male uh, this is a handicap bathroom handicap shower it's a little bigger so most people fight to use this one. <laughs> Got a shower and thankfully, uh, water hasn't been too bad, it's cold water, but because of the, the heat, the water is usually pretty warm. And if not, if it comes out cold, it's just r the right temperature for this heat. So there's three showers, a giant mirror, what's up? And uh, Three bathroom stalls, two normal and one handicapped. You can use. I won't show them too much because of, huh. they're very basic. And we got a lady that comes in and cleans the bathrooms and everything daily, so everything is hygienic. Back here we got a little, got a little seating area. Really nice place. Costa, I don't remember the cost. I'll put it in the I'll put it in the description below. I've been going through different stuff, looking uh, to book hostels and uh, hotel rooms, etc. For my whole travel, so I got so many prices up in my head right now. I can't remember, but it wasn't bad at all. I think it came up to a total of like fifty something Canadian for uh, how long have I been here? I've been here since Thursday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I was originally supposed to check out four nights. Yeah, like 50 Canadian for four nights. I stayed one extra night. And uh, that's the place. Real nice. I'll be sure to put the name and address and even the website link in the description. If you guys want to stay here, thanks for watching. And see you later.